ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Wonder Kid Watch, where today we have Jaheim Faustin from Trinidad and Tobago. This is a player that was mentioned in the comments, so make sure you leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes. And of course, leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss out on those players. Now, Faustin looks very nice. A very tidy looking player. 16 years old, so plenty of room to improve. Uh, currently playing for Jabale. Jablote, I should say, um, in Trinidad and Tobago. Made one appearance for the first team, so looks very, very promising. A striker with some good finishing and dribbling already, um, and his physicals aren't too bad either. Uh, let's take a look at his attributes, though, uh, and how he's got to this stage. 70 current ability, but 128 potential shows he's got a lot of room for growth. He's got plenty of time to reach that at the age of 16, um, so we'll be hitting him in his prime. Let's jump ahead, take a look how he gets on and how he develops. And here we are, 10 years on, Jaheim Faustin looking pretty similar to how he was. A little bit disappointing. I mean, his physicals look to have improved. Um, his finishing's actually gone down, I think, uh, if we look at that. Um, 75 caps, though, for Trinidad and Tobago with 24 goals, which isn't too bad. Um, and he is currently wanted by Gaziantep, um, which I believe is a Tur uh, Turkish team, maybe. Um but with that said, we can see he has moved on to W Connection. Um, and we'll take a look at his career and how things go for sure. Um, still a striker, not very versatile though, being able to play anywhere else really. Uh, let's take a look at the career. He's played for Jabotech and scored a few goals. Um, I mean, his best, not a bad season, 25-26. And then 26-27, he also managed to get three goals in five games before a move to Connection. Um Obviously still in Trinidad and Tobago, but over the last two seasons has certainly picked up his form a bit, getting double figures in his goals for the first time. Um, also contributing with assists as well. So that's quite nice to see. Um, Milestones-wise, though, we can see he was the Caribbean Club Championship winners um, and runners-up with Connection. Um, third place with Jabba the Tear. Um, otherwise... That's pretty much it. He got Golden Ball third place, Supporters Player of the Year, uh, Championship Golden third place again, best 11 for Trinidad Tobago, um, Golden Ball a few times, to be honest, actually with multiple, with both Jablote and Connection. So um, a decent player uh, and also young player award. So he's obviously shown a bit of potential. Um, it would be interesting to see how he gets on if he moved to uh, another country, another team. But with that said, let's take a look at his attributes. Um, we can see here he's only reached 105 current ability, uh, 128 with his potential. So he hasn't quite matched that, matched that milestone we'd have hoped, but um, still not too bad. He's not a bad player. Uh, I'd certainly look at bringing him in for maybe a backup in, in the English lower leagues. Uh, he, he could be half decent for you there. Um, but with that said, we will leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel. And of course, leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes. And I'll catch you in the next one.